Bowman here from BW1.com, and we're going to take a look at the newly announced Android Market Web Store that got announced at uh, Google's Honeycomb Web Conference today. It just got launched today as well, too, and it's going to be a new way for you to download and find new applications right for your Android devices. Pretty cool setup that they have here. Nice slick look. As you can see here at the top, they have uh, sort of featured applications that you can kind of scroll through uh, left and right here. And then um, they also have a section down here below for featured, top paid top free and um, also your different categories here on the side and then you have best selling games and I believe you go through different categories so if we go to applications you can see that um, business you can see that it um, categorizes everything from top paid to top free and uh, we'll go back to the home screen here and you can still also uh, search as well here at the top search for your favorite applications now uh, what's pretty cool is sort of the way you download it and you sign in with your Google account and um, this does work with Google Apps accounts, by the way, if you're a Google Apps user. So let's say we want to download Pulse Newsreader. Click on that here. And um, what you'll see is you'll see the rating. You'll see the description. You'll get some app screenshots. You can actually get videos now, which is um, new for the uh, web store. And you can see the reviews here as well, too. You can, you can hit the tab for the user reviews directly. You can see what's new um, as different revisions come out and what type of permissions that the application actually needs and also here on the side you can also see the uh, different related applications to it so if you like this you can you know install Google Reader World uh, Newspaper and things of that nature and um, let's say you decide you want to install this we'll click install and what it'll do is it'll link it'll bring up all the Android devices that are linked to your account so if I have more than just my Motorola Joy let's say I have a tablet or another phone it will show those there as well now what's cool here is um this one's free so from here on it just shows you one more time what the uh, permissions are then which is pretty cool and you can click show all to see everything and then all from here you need to do is click install and the app will be downloaded to the device shortly and we should see here in uh, just a few seconds on my Android device there it is right there it comes up and you can see it's starting to download and install pretty cool that's pretty much the way it works um you can share different applications you can tweet different applications to people and um you share links along the way so if you send a, send someone an email it'll open up an android um android market web store if they open a link on their phone it'll open up to the android market directly to that directly to that application on the android market on the phone pretty cool stuff there and um the only other thing i would say to be a little bit different is if you go to a paid application such as uh let's say we want a 299 we'll just use this as an example Wait for it to load up. Same thing as before. We'll click continue. But you see here, it'll have your saved uh, credit card information and, and stuff like that already set up in here. So you need to click to complete your purchase, and you'll be able to purchase the app just like that as well too. So other than that, that's pretty much it for the uh, Android uh, Market Web Store. This is really cool. This is going to make it, I think, a lot easier and also uh, help you discover way more Android ap applications than you could before. This is obviously in the line, obviously came out on the lines for you know not only the phone but the tablets and other Android devi Android um, OS devices that are coming out. So this is pretty cool here. So definitely check it out. All you need to do is sign in with your um, Android, uh, sign in with your Google account that you are on your Android phone, and that's pretty much it. So this is Bowman here from BW1.com reminding you, subscribe to our YouTube page, follow us on Twitter, and always remember to live your tech world in high definition.